Well, hello, and welcome to my latest video. No, it's not cycling, and it's not a movie review, and I'm not going to say anything about my latest book, Old Friends to the End, Cycling from Land's End to John O'Groats, which is now available from Amazon. No, it's not about that. It is an unboxing, or as I like to say in my form glay, unboxing the jewels and what sort of unboxing is it well you're going to be are you going to be surprised i don't know if you're going to be surprised you might be a little bit excited you might even be a little bit anticipatory to know what is actually in julian's package today and let's have a look well the first thing we've got is a um, an iphone case you're thinking Julian, you haven't. You haven't. Have you? You haven't. And I don't know what this is. Uh, this is part of the package. This is part of the box. And it's Crystallusion Active Bacteria Protection. And it says clinically tested and proven to have virucidal activity against all enveloped viruses. Do you have any idea what that means? Now, when you get um, a cycling, or some like cycling stuff from Chain Reaction or Wiggle or Sigma or something like that, you get a little bit of, little packet of Haribo, little packet of sweets. I don't think this is sweets, kids. And if your kids are watching this, this is not sweets. I have no idea what it is, other than what it says. Crystallusion, leave a comment down below if you know what it is. And this is an iPhone 13 Pro Silicon case. You're thinking, Julian, are we getting to the knob of the matter? The nub, sorry, are we getting to the nub of the matter? We may well be. Um, this says get up to six months free Apple Music. You're thinking, we, Julian, you haven't, you haven't, you haven't. Oh, yes, yes. Oh, how could he have done this? He has got himself a new iPhone 13. Now you're thinking, oh, Julian, do you always have to have the latest stuff? No, it's not like that, funnily enough. I currently have uh, an iPhone XS. And I thought I'd check my uh, upgrade options as I'm with O2. And it says, yes, you, you can get an upgrade. You've come to the end of your last vastly expensive contract. And you can now take out a new vastly, even more vastly expensive contract and get the, yes, wait for it, iPhone, not unlucky for some, 13. I'm going to say, first of all, right, a lot of people are very sniffy about Apple and they don't like Apple. I have always loved Apple products. I've, had, I've got iMacs, iPads, iPhones, I've even got an Apple Watch, as various people have commented on. And I think the design of Apple products and the innovation of Apple products is absolutely amazing. And it is one of the uh, industrial uh, successes, one of the in almost industrial revolutions, I would say. The technological revolution has been partly driven by Apple. And I have no problem, actually, with Amazon being wealthier than most countries, and I suspect including this one, uh, especially after what we've managed to do to ourselves over the last couple of years. But this is not that kind of video. Um, I'm not really going to do, uh, well, I'll do a sort of unboxing, because you've been, you know, this this phone has only just come out, so you probably want to, to see it. Oh, my God. Oh, that is, oh, is that not beautiful? Because, you know, if you want to watch, what's that guy, Peter McKinnon, um, and all the other thousands of YouTube videos that there will be about the iPhone 13 and its specs and what it can do and, and the great things about it and things that people don't like about it and so on and so forth. I just want to say that I love Apple products. I am really, really pleased to get an iPhone 13, the new one. I'm going to set it up. I'm going to transfer the stuff over from my Apple uh, X, XS in excess. No, not in excess. X, X, yeah, it was a, it's an Apple 10, but they called it the X. Yes, I'm getting confused now. Um, and maybe when I've transferred that, I'll come back and do a bit more of this video. So 
Don't go away. Don't go away. Did you go away? You you went away, didn't you? You came back too soon. No, no, don't don't come back now. Come back in a bit. You can there you, are. you can just look at the phone a bit more. And that on the reverse, that's the triple lensed camera, one of the best cameras there is in a in a phone. And even uh, um, yeah, a, a really great camera. So you know, shall I do a kind of shall I do a kind of reveal? It's not a reveal, is it? Because you've already seen it, but you know what I mean. Beautiful, isn't it? It's quite heavy as well. It's quite weighty. Anyway, that's enough, Jimmy. That's enough. Well, I'm back. It's uh, two weeks later. <laughs> had, a, had a little bit of trouble setting up the old uh, iPhone. Actually, there was something I wanted to show you. So uh, don't go away. I'll be back. Don't go away. No, I am back, seriously. The reason it took me uh, nearly two and a half weeks to set it up is because, you see this? I can hold this up to the camera. Uh, now, the trouble is holding it up to the camera makes it look bigger than it really is. So let me try and find something for scale. Okay, well, here's, here's the phone, right? So here's this for scale. And oh, my fingers got a bit of a shake there. I can't, I can't read it, guys. I can't read it. Look, look at that. Look, look. You see that? Can you read that? I'm 65 years old, right? My eyes are fucked. I can't read stuff that is written in that size of print. I'm not sure I could ever read it, frankly, with glasses or without glasses, without eyes, even with eyes, without eyes. I just can't read it. So Apple and everybody else, all you other technological companies, please, please, please try and understand that some people cannot read a piece of paper that is this size. And what is wrong with in the box, okay, here's the box, beautifully designed box, as always, right? What is wrong with putting in a decent sized piece of paper that anyone with any sense can read like this, as opposed to having to get a magnifying glass and to look on there and say, to see how to set up your real phone, go to www.apple. We're going to show you how to set up your phone if you've got eyesight that can read minusculeprint.com forward slash help um, in order to set up your phone. So why, why not make it easier? Um, what other moans have I got? Um, it comes with a lightning cable, lightning on one end, USB-C on the other. So you need to have a special plug that's got a USB-C um, female. Is it female? <laughs> Come on, Julian, you're 65. You ought to know these kind of things. You've got two children. Right, it's female, so you can put the male plug into it, right? So you have to buy a special plug. Oh, come on, Apple. Right, you know, it's the best part of a thousand pounds for the fact I got it on credit, so I didn't pay a thousand pounds for it. I'm just going to be paying for the, for the rest of my stupid life. Um, yeah, so you have to get a special plug in order to plug your cable into it. I mean, could you, could you not have included a, a plug in the box? I mean, you know, it, you just. You're such a wonderful company and you do such wonderful technological things and then you you know you you kind of I was knew you were going to say something rude but you 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 shoot yourselves in the foot yes that's the kind of clean version of it you shoot yourselves in the foot by doing something like that I still don't understand why I've got a tube of, of crystal vision I suspect it's some kind of you know cream for stuff to do with piles but um, maybe I'll put it on and see if it works uh, then they've sent me this Right, this thing here, which says protect your phone better. And I mean, have you ever seen so much single use cardboard packaging? Right, there's a box. Inside the box, there is a box. Inside that box, there is an envelope, uh, actually two envelopes. And it's inside this envelope, there is what I presume is the plastic screen inside another envelope. And inside this envelope, there is another envelope which has got uh, these little bits of stuff on it and a bit of stuff to clean your lens, okay? But, but, nowhere are there any instructions, all right? Now, you get this kind of thing, which may or may not be an iPhone 13 holder. I really don't know. You're obviously supposed to do something with this. You probably put your phone in there in order to put the screen on. There's no instructions. It, it doesn't tell you what to do. Now, I suppose I'm going to have to go onto the internet and look up www.whereareTheFuckingInstructions.com Com. Actually, I might buy that website because I, I could make a shedload. Was it shitload? Shitload of shedload 
of money. So that's not really telling you much about the iPhone, is it? Um, there it is. Well, I'll switch it on. It looks just like an iPhone XS. There is uh, some clever stuff going on in the camera. Oh, look, there's, there's my face, right? And you've got what they call cinematic styles. I don't know if you can... No, you probably can't see. But if I turn it around like that, right, then you... Oh, look, I'm looking... Oh, I can't see that. No, it's looking the other way, isn't it? You want it to look that way, don't you? Does that... Hmm, is that my face? It is my face, isn't it? It looks a bit weird, doesn't it? Um, let me turn it round. So that's looking... Well, I can't see what that's looking at. That's looking at me. And I look rather nice, actually, but you can't see me. Well, you can see me, but you can't see me on this phone. I can't... If, if I'm like that, right, I'm looking at the phone, I'm seeing myself, I think I look really rather good. So if I turn it around really quickly, right, if you look really quickly, you might just see me. So ready, I'm going to do it after three. Ready, one, two, three, go. Ah, you missed it. You went quick enough. We'll try it again, right? Uh, so I'm looking at the screen, right? I look really good on the screen. Shit, I, I don't know what Apple have done, but they've really improved my look. So, right, I'm going to turn it around really quickly and then you can see what I look like. So we're going to do it on three. Are you ready? Are you ready? Count to three, right, right, ready? One, two, three, go. Oh, oh, oh you missed it again. I'm, I'm not doing it again. So there you are, Apple iPhone 13. Um, it's a phone. What more do you want? It takes pictures. What more do you want? It may, might even make calls. Um, I don't know. I never get any calls. And I never need to make any calls. Occasionally. Uh, occasionally I'll make some calls. And uh, apps. Got a lot of apps on it. But um, um, anyway, let's get off that. So there it is. That's what it looks like from the uh, front side. That's what it looks like from the back side, if you pardon my language. And uh, it's a nice looking machine. And I expect to have endless hours of fun about it. But if you want to learn all the stuff about it, Google it. <laughs> Google it. Or go to www apple uh what the hell is all this new shit about the iphone 13.com thanks for watching see you next time